Hey guys, what's going on? Um, today I'm gonna make this video as simple as possible. Um, I'm gonna be showing you how to connect to um, a GoDaddy hosting account through an SSH client. I'm using Bitvise. Um, basically the reason to do this would be to um, download uh, files from your hosting directory onto your computer um, very quickly easily um, okay. and you can also upload to your directory so it, it works both ways um, first what you're gonna want to do is download bitvise and you can do this by going to bitvise.com Go to download and you're gonna want to download the tunneler version I already have it downloaded so I'm not gonna go through it but after you're done downloading it just launch the program and launch it this is what it's gonna look like okay for this to work you're gonna need the host of the server the port by default it's 22 so put in 22 okay your username and uh, password to find all this information go to your GoDaddy account and log in and log in Alright, go to your web hosting and uh, find the account you want to use and click the manage button. It's green. This is going to open up the C panel where you'll find all the information, okay? Okay, your username that you're going to need to type in right here is right here. That's the username. The host, your server's host, is right here. It's an IP address. Port 22 and your password for your cPanel. If for some reason you forgot your cPanel password, all you have to do is reset it. Go to uh, cPanel hosting right here at the top. Click on hosting. Click settings. Click on password and you're gonna type in a new password. Okay, it's pretty easy. Um, and this should be it. Um, here we're gonna try to connect. Type in your host. Oh, there's one more thing. Once you have all this information typed in, For this to work, you're gonna have to go all the way down and click on SSH access. Enable. Okay, this is gonna make sure it works. All right. So there you go. Okay, so this is good. User authentication. Um, I had the password wrong the whole time, so type in your password. Click OK. Okay, that's wrong. Click OK. Complete. Okay, uh, channel's opening. Here we go. This is uh, going to pop up right here, is what we're looking at. Um, here's my desktop. And here's my remote files. This is my GoDaddy directory. Okay, so like public HTML. 
let's say um, one of my websites for example okay Angel of Grace um, here's all the files in the directory all I have to do is simply click uh, say I want to download these files I have those checked uh, if I want to download them to this folder right here I click that and you simply just click download okay um, download and that's gonna pretty much download these files right here to this folder right here now it's gonna take a uh, it depends on how big the file size are um, how long it takes but yeah we're not gonna do this right now we're just that's an example of how this works okay pretty cool and uh, if you wanted to put something on your desktop from your desktop to your remote file all you have to click is upload so if I clicked upload this folder it would go into this remote file there you have it if you have any questions please let me know um, if you run into any problems just um, let me know I'll try to do my best to help you um, thanks guys uh, don't forget to subscribe if this video helped you and like it please